So the Chiefs are in Pyeongchang, sort of. A Chief, I guess. One of the players is there, but not to watch the Winter Olympics as a fan. He is there to work. That's right. 41 Action News reporter Stephen Dial is live at Arrowhead with more on this once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. How cool. Good morning. Laurent Duvernay Tardif came to the Chiefs in 2014 from Canada. And after talking to him, I learned really quickly that he does much more than protecting the quarterback on Sundays. And starting at guard from McGill University in Montreal, Quebec, Canada, number 76, Laurent Duvernay Tardif. Growing up, Laurent Duvernay Tardif's parents told him to touch everything in life. He didn't play football until he was a teen. Now he's in the NFL. When he's not in his jersey, a white coat is his uniform. In the offseason, he's a medical student in Canada. Bonjour, ici Laurent. Now he's in front of the camera. Le privilège de monter au sommet du tremplin. When you're in the locker room in Kansas City, you don't realize how much work the media put in in order to get access to you, you know? And, and now that I'm at the Olympic, I'm struggling with PR agent and all that stuff, trying to get access to athletes after they win a medal. And I'm like, dang, that thing is hard, you know? So now I can appreciate a little more uh, the work of the media. He's currently working for CBC during the Winter Olympics. It's been amazing. Like being in the Olympics, you know, it's one thing to see a gold medal being won on television, but to see it real time uh, and then interview the athlete, do the little pieces, uh, it's just an awesome feeling. An awesome feeling inspiring him to learn even more about South Korea. I just enjoy the culture. I, I love food. Uh, and, and just go from like a barbecue, Korean barbecue places to like a sashimi places by the coast and, and you know, try Try to like really live the culture, uh, be with, with be with the people. So after the Olympics, what's next? He will go back to Canada for two months to study as he hopes to complete medical school this spring. Then he'll come back here to Kansas City for OTAs and spring training. What can't this guy do? Back to you guys. He what does a great it all. Story. What a great story. It is awesome. And it gives you more appreciation Thanks, for a guy who's right there on the front lines during the game that you might not pay attention to. Now you should. Speaking of the Chiefs.